A slew of big retailers set to report earnings this week, including names like Home Depot, Lowe's, Kohl's, Target, Best Buy, and Foot Locker. So ahead of all the big earnings releases, we thought it'd be a great time okay. to play. Shop it or drop it! That's right. Oh, no. Shop it or drop it. One of our favorite games here at Fast Money. We kick things off today with Kohl's down 5% this year, set to report tomorrow. So, Tim, first contestant up. Shop it or drop well, it. Let's get out of the gates clear. Sometimes these games are hard. I'm dropping this one. Um, I Meaning just think you're, you're uh, not buying it. You're selling it. I'm selling it. I like it. it. I, I, yeah, good. I, I thought I just it was clear. Make sure. it's, I, mean, I just want to make sure. For the people at home, you I'm played selling it, it. I'm dropping it. I'm dropping it. it. I'm perfectly. taking it out of my basket and I'm throwing it back out because I think Kohl's is one of uh, about nine uh, big box stores that are under a lot of margin pressure from labor. Uh, they're going to be under major margin pressure from, from import prices that are going higher. And I think at some point we are so far overstored in terms of floor space per capita in this country for these types of stores. That's why they're all beating each other up on competitive forces. I don't want to own it here. I really just clarified that for Guy. For, yeah. So when he plays, he understands. First of all, you know, I like music. Happening. And when all the artists drop things, they drop their music. That's a positive thing. Exactly. So if you're just in the music genre, and when you're so, shopping something, like the Mets are probably shopping 90% of their team, that's a bad thing. So, I mean, you can understand how I'd get confused. Well, that's why I With clarified. that said, <laughs> I, would, I would, now they report tomorrow before the bell, as you we mentioned. That, the stock yeah. has gone from 76 down to 62. 60 was the low, I would say, over the fall. I would shop it. So put that graphic up and say, you know what? It's had a huge move to the downside. Everything Tim talked about is probably priced in. They report tomorrow. Hope it flushes to 60. Then you shop that sucker, Mel. Mark, what would you say? Uh, I'd be shopping this one. So I think they've got a huge po positive catalyst that's out there right now with their, their partnership with Amazon. So, you know, they do have the ability, and they're going to be adding that to stores over the course of the next few quarters. They're going to have the ability to accept returns from Amazon, which is going to drive foot traffic right into their store. So I'd be shopping it. Next stock. Foot Locker up four percent this year. Dan, shop uh, it or drop it. Mel, I'm shopping this one, and you know I'm just going to kind of channel my inner Karen Fairman if I could. Mm -hmm. This is a big name with her for a while here. This thing is actually really cheap. I was just looking at it. They report Friday morning before the opening. It trades about ten times. Um, you know, earnings are per share expected to grow ten percent this year, uh, mid to low single digit sales growth. They just made an investment in the Goat. App guy, you know what the goat stands Greatest for? Greatest of all time. Yeah, well, nice. that's a that's a sneaker oh, marketplace a okay. that also owns Flight Club here in New York and in LA. And these guys are doing a partnership with them. I think that gives them a certain amount of cred within this demographic that's growing in the sneaker universe. So to me, I think you could see them actually buy goat at some point. This would be a very interesting online offline combination, in my opinion. I think it's a cheap stock. I think it's going higher. You like Nike, so do you like FL? I like Nike. I'd rather have DTC right. through Nike. I don't think, you know, FL ultimately, I think they have a place, but I think the valuation needs to be, the multiples should be moving lower. Therefore, I would be dropping, not shopping. Oh. Now, did you look up uh. GOAT on your internet? No, it's web funny because somebody because... put that on like a hashtag GOAT on uh -huh. the, on their, on the you... Twitter machine, and I, so I looked I it up. It up then. And, and the first thing it said was like the An animal, animal GOAT. And I said, it can't be that. And GOAT then... Boy on Saturday Night Live? No. Yeah, that was one of the best yeah. skits ever. Boy, boy. Boy. Yeah. Shop it we'll or it drop it for Locker. I would, you know what? Drop it. I know Dan's a, a shop it. I'm going to drop it. I mean, if you look, this has had a huge move off the lows. It was a $30 stock a year and a half ago. It's had a huge move. I think a lot of it's priced in. I would, what do I got to do? Drop it ahead Wait, of earnings. What about your thing at ET last week that set me off? That's New it. retail. You new got retail. Out. And let me tell you something. You're I am a millennial, but I've been buying kicks on the Goat app, and I think it's pretty cool. And I think that's one way to get kids do you back wanna, into this Do you want to show us what you're wearing right now? No, please. Oh, those are his fancy sneakers. Wow. Um, we're right. going to move on now. <laughs> uh, Lowe's reporting Wednesday. Mark Tepper, shop it or drop it. Yeah, so I'm going to shop this one. So the consumer is still strong and existing home inventories are low, which means more and more consumers are going to opt to fix up the homes they're already living in. And I do prefer Lowe's over Home Depot. And they, with their new CEO in place, it's more of a turnaround story. So I'd be shopping this one. I like that. Would you rather within shop it or drop it? That's a game within a game. It's very complicated. Yeah, and so and let me use a <laughs> metaphor. The opposite guys used a Mets metaphor on shopping. And might, you know, how about the Yankees are probably shopping for a new third baseman because because their, their third baseman's out for the year. So if I'm going to Lowe's, um, I'm also shopping this one because I do think it trades at a discount to Home Depot. People might say because of what's going on in the housing market, what's going on with taxes and salt states and whatnot, that actually uh, 
people will be under pressure to invest in their homes. I think with rates falling through the floor, people are taking out fresh home equity loans and they're going and reinvesting in their homes. Next talk, L Brands. Mm -hmm. Shop it or drop it. Guy. Now, in, the, in a vacuum, I drop it, but in the aggregate, I drop it. And we've been steadfast on dro <laughs> so no, dropping because it no matter it's on, what. Well, we've talked, we said it. What's Drop vacuum? this thing, huh? What does that mean? For, it your, means we've vacuum. said stay away from this for years, despite the fact that we play the gratuitous, gratuitous footage, yeah. which you all like. I'm not a fan of. We've said stay away, and that's Why been don't correct. You like it? I just don't like that. We don't need to do a that thing. It's a family show. I mean, it just it makes no sense on so many different levels. If it rallies after earnings, you sell it again. 